Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Will's Kitchen Table. Guys, Chef Will is here again with another amazing recipe for you guys. Guys, today it's pretty simple for me. Um, it's a sweet and sour meatballs I'm gonna be making, guys, today with some noodles. And I will also have some sweet and sour shrimp I'm gonna be doing as well. That's going on the kitchen table today as well, guys. Um, yeah, so um, we're just gonna jump right in and get the beef, um, the ground beef um, with some marinade inside of it right now. All right, so this is my beautiful ground beef I got right there. Um, so we're gonna be putting in some spices right now. So I got um, green onions right here, guys. This is um, a quarter cup of our green onions chopped. And I got uh, four cloves of garlic mince right here. And I got a teaspoon of uh, ground ginger, a teaspoon of brown sugar, and a half a teaspoon of black pepper there, guys, and a half a teaspoon of salt. Guess I'm using um, soy sauce. My soy sauce is two tablespoon. That's already salty. So um, yeah, and I got two tablespoon of um, flour right here. That's going in, and a pinch of um, chili peppers. All right. Guys, I'm gonna put the sesame oil right in. The sesame oil, it's two tablespoon. I'm gonna drizzle that over it. All right. And we're gonna have the soya sauce in as well. Looking good. And our salt. sugar and our ginger and chili onions and garlic I'm just gonna mix this right in guys I'll add the flour after we give this a good mix I just use the flour to help bind it you really don't have to as long as you got some Fat in the meat, but I'm using the lean ground beef right here. Um, not much fat in it to hold it together. And I don't want to over mix the meat, right? So, add the flour to that. That looks good. You yeah, guys, you don't want to overwork the meat, right? All right? Yeah, so I'm just gonna go ahead and roll these up. I'm gonna make small ones, guys. Um, I'll just show you guys the size that I'm gonna be working with for my sweet and sour meatballs. And I'm gonna go for that size, all right? Really small ones. All right, so guys, I'm gonna roll these up. All right, and then I'll get right back to you guys. So guys, I rolled up the meatballs and that's what they came out looking like. And guys, um, I didn't tell you guys how much ground beef I was using. Uh, the ground beef that I was using, it's um, uh, 0 0.850 um, kg. That's what I use, work out to about a pound and something. All right, guys, that's what I'm using right here. I think it's one pound, um, 0.874. All right, guys, that's what it works out to. So guys, I'm gonna get a pot on there to get these all sauteed. I got some veggies to cut up and all that, and um, we're gonna prolong with it, all right? Hello, guys. I'm gonna start the sweet and sour sauce right now. I got some right here Guys, this is a uh, one cup of um, ketchup. I got right here and um, I got a tablespoon of soy sauce and I got a tablespoon of oil in here guys 
rice wine vinegar, I got half a cup, and I'm gonna use uh, about a tablespoon of cornstarch in there, and I got half a cup of brown sugar. All right, guys, so that's what I'm gonna get for the sweet and sour sauce going right now. And I also have a cup of uh, fresh pineapple juice. I just blend that out, guys, and strain the pineapple. All right, that's gonna go right in the pot right here as well. All right, this is just a ketchup mixed with all, um, mixed with the rest of the ingredient, guys. So we're gonna get that started right now. I'm gonna get the pineapple juice right in here. All right, so we're gonna get that going right now, guys. So these are all the veggies that's gonna go with the sweet and sour shrimp and with the sweet and sour uh, meatballs. Um, um, I got veggies here for my noodles as well, the Cantonese noodles, green onions, guys. I got garlic right here. So we're gonna cook up a storm right now, all right? You guys can see, I got the meatballs going right now. Cooking these off, get some nice color on them, guys. They're looking good. So, guys, you just want to cook these, give them some nice color on the outside, and then remove them from that oil. So, all that oil is coming from the from the beef guys so we're just gonna remove them from the oil get them in another bowl I got over here and we're gonna start our veggies for the sweet and sour okay so guys I got all the peppers onions going on right here a little bit of celery inside as well and that's for the sweet and sour meatballs Put a little bit of green onions in here, guys. What a handful. I'm gonna have some garlic. Just toss that around nicely, guys. And now we just have the beef rice in here guys, just going to stir that up, and we're going to turn the flame down, this is looking lovely, beautiful, what I'm going to do guys, we're going to add sweet and sour sauce right over this. Lovely. Wow, guys, this is looking good and smelling good. Mm. Wow, bring you guys closer. And see what's going on in the pot right there. All that beautiful sweet and sour meatballs going on, guys. Mm. Wow. Looking good. So, guys, this is done. I'm going to set it aside and we're going to get the shrimp going. All right. Wow. It's looking beautiful guys. 
nice dish. Sweet and sour meatballs. All right. So guys, I got 454 grams of shrimp right here, guys. And all I did, I just put a teaspoon of fresh garlic in there, guys. A tablespoon of um, soya sauce and some uh, two tablespoons of oil. That's all I used to marinate the shrimp, guys. And we're gonna get it right in its wash with some lime and devein, guys. Um, it's very important to devein your shrimp. All right, guys, I'm gonna get them down right now. Let's sprinkle a little bit of black pepper over this, guys. We're just gonna cook these off. Guys, the shrimp is looking beautiful. It smells so good. Guys, I leave the tail on. The tails are on, guys, um, for flavor. You want to leave your tails on the shrimp so you get some flavor inside. A little bit of shell. Mm. Guys, it smells so good, guys. You think you're in the restaurant right now? Going. All right, guys, we're turning up the flavor right here. Guys, this reminds me of the good old restaurant days, guys. Oh. From scratch. Guys, we're just gonna pour the sauce right over this. Put it in low. That looks good. Wow. Beautiful. Guys, this is what we're talking about. That's how we turn up the flavor here at Will's Kitchen Table. You guys can see all the goodness going on in that. Looking beautiful. Guys, that sweet and sour shrimp right there. All right. Gonna get the noodles going right now, guys. Beautiful. So guys, I just had a pinch of um, chili pepper to this, guys. That's optional, you don't have to. But I like a little bit of spice, all right? So guys, that's a Cantonese noodle. I just drop it in the boiling water. There's some soy sauce in there. And I'm just gonna pull it out right now. Just for like a minute in the water. We're gonna get it in this pan over here with all the veggies. We're gonna cook. Guys, this, all this veggies here going right inside my noodle. With a pinch of chili pepper. So this is cabbage I got here guys, a little bit of carrot, some onions, and some celery inside here, and a little bit of bok choy. So guys, this is the finished product right here. I have the sweet and sour meatballs and the sweet and sour shrimp. Guys, 
it's so delicious you can see my daughter already digs into it um but this is what we're having for dinner tonight guys all right sweet and sour meatballs sweet and sour shrimp i got some veggies right there and the noodles i just tossed the noodles with the veggies that i saute right there and um that's what it looks like guys all right so guys i'm so hungry i'm gonna dig right in right now i just want to thank you guys again for watching like share guys subscribe to this channel guys thanks to all you guys out there support and watching my videos and i'll see you guys in the next one